Russia sold Alaska for just 7.2 million, which is two cents per acre. But why did Russia sell such a mineral-rich and valuable land to the U.S. for a very small amount? Russia had been interested in colonizing Alaska since the 1730s, but they made little effort to settle there, and only a small number of merchants and fur trappers ventured into the area. The Russians were worried about the prospect of having to defend the territory in the event of a war with the United Kingdom, and some feared that the Americans might take it by force. On the other hand, President Andrew Johnson and Secretary of State William H. Seward viewed the acquisition of Alaska as an opportunity to expand the country's territory in line with the principle of manifest destiny. The purchase was initially met with skepticism, and many people derisively referred to it as Seward's folly. This perception changed after gold was discovered in the territory.